Okay, so this is going to be a quick tutorial on how to set Tricking Zero up in order to be on the playtest version of the game so that you can play custom maps as well as how to download them and how to make sure they run properly. So first things first, what you want to do is head into Steam, go into your library and find your Tricking Zero. Now once you located your Tricking Zero in your Steam library, right click it, go down to Properties go to betas and here under beta participation make sure you are playing on the early builds open early builds this is the playtest of the version so just click that once you've done that it will probably update uh, so give it time make sure it finished up then launch the game just to make sure it is set up correctly now once steam is updated launch tricking zero head into free mode and arenas And here the quickest way to figure out whether or not it's worked is click this pause menu and if you have spot builder it has worked. Now once we've verified that everything has been updated correctly and everything is working as it should head into the Tricking Zero Discord and down to the channel called Map Labs. This is where you're going to find all of the custom maps made by the community. Now for this tutorial I'm going to be using the whole dive map so what you want to do first is make sure you download the PNG file this is going to be the thumbnail for your map inside the game. Then you need to download the .json files. Now after those have been downloaded, you can close down Discord and open up your file explorer. For ease sake, I've just placed them here on the desktop. Now what you want to do is click into this PC, which is where you're going to find your PC's drive. Then head into Windows C go down until you find users then pick your username inside this map we are looking for the app data folder right here however if you haven't made sure it is visible you need to click into view go down to show and show hidden items that will make sure the app data folder shows up then go into local low and go down to tricking zero, tricking zero again, and maps. Drag both the PNG and the JSON file in here. Since I already have this map installed, it will ask me to replace it. You can close out of that as well, and now launch tricking zero again. Now once tricking zero has loaded up, go into free mode and arena. Now here we are back in arenas, so what you want to do next is press this pause button, go down to spot builder, in the top right corner you're going to see a button for the menu, so press that, go into load map, pick the map you want to load, we're going to use hold dive for this one, click right on the d-pad in order to head over to this invisible square, press A to mark it as a favourite, and then you can simply go back and restart it. The reason we do this is because if you don't do this and just restart the map, you're not going to spawn in where the creator intended you to spawn in. But that is how you download custom maps.